hello everyone and welcome back to my channel my name is Ali if you're new here and today I have my nighttime routine as a stay-at-home mom of three so my nighttime routine typically starts after dinner has been cooked and we're kind of winding down and cleaning up dinner after cleaning up after dinner so I usually start in the living room because my husband and I usually eat in the living room so we have dishes, drinks, trash, things like that. I've been probably lounging around so there's blankets to fold so I always start in the living room just by getting things put back into their place. Once the living room is complete, I head into the dining area and we're just going to go ahead and get this table wiped off. Nighttime, I do have my kids wipe it off, but obviously they're small children, so I kind of have to go in there and rub the sticky stuff off from throughout the day because they do just enough to make it look clean, but it's not actually clean, so I go in there to make sure it's actually clean. Once the dining area is done, it's time to head into the kitchen to go ahead and start getting things put away that don't belong in the kitchen, as well as packing up the leftovers from dinner that night, making my husband's plate, and then obviously putting whatever other leftovers are done in the Tupperware and put away into the fridge. Once the counters are cleared off and things are put back into their place, it's time to go ahead and start on the dishes. And I mean, it's just doing dishes. If they're a little bit greasy like these were their specific night, I will rinse them off with some Dawn Power Wash and then stick them into the dishwasher. And then I will clean, wash the sink out once I am done loading the dishwasher. Let's set the tone, a bottle of red wine and pheromones. The conversation Trust my senses, catch me if I fall So done with second guessing, you seem to have it all In love enough for anything, emotional too soon You got my invitation, now the rest is up to you Kick it rendezvous, make some time for me and you Get you over, treat you right Once dishes are done, I do go ahead and go in and just wipe off the stove, the countertops, and I like to do this before I sweep because if there's any crumbs or anything on the countertops, then those get wiped off onto the floor and then they'll get swept up once it is time to sweep. It's something in the way you talk, I'll show my hand, let's play it out, putting my heart up on the table. I really trust my senses, catch me if I fall. So done with second guessing, you seem to have it all. In loving the for anything, emotional. 
emotion all too soon You got my invitation, now the rest is up to you Kick it, rendezvous, make some time for me and you Get you over, treat you right Once the kitchen is complete, that pretty much wraps up our cleaning, so it's just time to go ahead and get the lights turned off, get my tripod put up from filming, and just, like I said, just start winding the house down, getting the temperature right, and things like that. While I'm cleaning, my husband does go ahead and start the diffuser, so that is a part of our nighttime routine, but that is not one of my tasks to do. So once everything in the house is kind of shut down, laid down, and calmed down, it's time for me to go ahead and get some alone time. So I brush my teeth every night, obviously because I have braces, so don't want to risk any food getting stuck in those and then just waking up with super bad breath. I am going to go ahead and use my water pick floss thing and then take a shower and just like I said, relax my body, calm my body down, and start getting myself into a restful state. Lucky. After my shower, I do have a nighttime skincare routine that I've shared plenty of time in like shorts versions. Um, I use all of the same products, but not all of the same brands. From time to time, the brands will change if that makes sense. And then after skincare, we will go in with a little bit of body oil and body lotion. Stuck in the past watching videos of us. 
I have been trying to get rid of your stuff But voices in my head are telling me to stop It's all I have left, all I have of you Thought I was more than a body to hold, baby I wanted you, wanted us to be something more I was so sure, let my guard down for you Baby, why'd you have to love me, love me like that? I gave you my heart and you tore it apart Don't know why you had to hurt me, hurt me like that Cause now I'm messed up, drinking now Once I am done in the bathroom with my nighttime refreshing i guess you could say it's time to head into the room i get my foam roller i get my little five minute nighttime devotional and prayer and as i am popping my back on the foam roller because at this point that's pretty much all i use it for i will go ahead and read my nighttime devotional and pray and i pray in this position here um it's just what's comfortable to me and then i do try to do at least five to ten minutes of stretching every night and that just helps me really wind down for the night so sure let my guard down for you baby why'd you have to love me love me like that i gave you my heart and you tore it apart don't know why you had to hurt me hurt me like that Cause now i'm messed up drinking non-stop all right, and once I am done stretching, I turn on my heating pad because I do sleep with this on my lower back every night. And then it's time for me to lay down and go to sleep. I hope that you guys enjoyed this. And let me know what are some things that you do in your nighttime routine that you think I should add to mine. I love you guys, but remember that Jesus loves you more. And I will see you guys in my next video.